So we're starting with a, just a basic general aviation airplane here. It gives us something to start with. We don't have to spend a lot of time designing an airplane. So what we're doing is we're just focusing on the electric systems today. So what you see here is a, is a Technum airplane. It's built in Italy, and we've modified it with all electric systems. So that's where the focus of our testing is, to look at that. Um, so, so as time goes on, you'll be able to see these technologies actually move into real commercial airplanes as companies come in and build these for commercial products that people can use. So there's a number of interesting new markets for electric airplanes. The, the first one's called urban air mobility, and there's many, many companies trying to get into this, this, this area. So if you, if you think of like an air taxi, imagine a taxi, but in 3D, a, a vehicle that can lift off the ground and take you around a big city, say, 20 to 50 to 100 miles. Um, so that's a really interesting application for electric vehicles. And, and so you need electricity, electric vehicles to be able to enable that kind of market. So that's one market. The other one is sort of short haul flights where you have like 20 to 50 passengers. Currently today, those kinds of, of airplane designs are too expensive for an airline to actually operate. So when you introduce electricity, electric systems, you can make the operations much, much cheaper and just enable something that doesn't exist today. So NASA is a government agency. We don't get involved in commercial application, in commercial products. So we're developing technologies and then trying to help the certification agencies, like in our country, the FAA, Federal Aviation Administration. And how are you going to certify these electric airplanes? You have new electric motors, controllers, uh, battery systems. How do you make those safe um, so that we have a, a transportation mode that is, you know, safe like flying in a regular commercial aircraft. It's it's very exciting for us. So I know for me and Tim Williams, the other pilot, is going to be flying it. For Armstrong to be getting back into the crude X plane work is, is very exciting for us. Uh, it's cutting edge technology, so we're really excited and uh, uh, we're looking forward to the challenges. We're going to, you know, smartly get it done, and hopefully, what we produce will be beneficial to the community. Robert